least 15 killed in second day of anti-UN violence in DRC. At least 15 people were killed and about 50 wounded during a second day of violent anti-United Nations protests in the Democratic Republic of the Congo's eastern cities of Goma and Butembo, authorities have said. The dead included demonstrators and UN personnel as UN sites were attacked by crowds. A Reuters journalist reported seeing UN peacekeepers shoot dead two protesters as people threw rocks, vandalized, and set fire to UN buildings in Goma. The demonstrations began on Monday when hundreds of people attacked and looted a UN warehouse in the city, a regional hub for international aid groups demanding the mission leave the country. They fled again on Tuesday and spread to Butembo, about 200 kilometers north of Goma. Protesters were initially peaceful but turned violent as some picked tear gas grenades off the ground and threw them back at the Monusco warehouse. The protests were called by a faction of the ruling party's youth wing that accuses the UN mission, known as Monusco, of failing to protect civilians against military violence. One peacekeeper and two UN police personnel were killed when their base in Butembo was attacked, the UN spokesperson said. Butembo's police chief, Pong Goma, said the seven civilians were also killed when the peacekeepers retaliated. The situation is very volatile and reinforcements are being mobilized. Deputy UN spokesperson Fahan Haq said, adding that UN forces had been told to exercise maximum restraint and only fire warning shots. This is BBS News. Thank you and see you in the next videos.